That would have been a better option because I could use the dive. Or well, honestly, you, move. You, you could just straight up do that overhead lunge kick. It's a very quick move. If he's not holding block already, the he's overhead gonna get lunge kick? her little axe kick. It moves forward so fast. It's oh, unsafe, yeah. but you know, Maybe. just things to make them think. I'll work on it. Yeah. I'll work on it. It's just one of those things. You got to grind out this matchup. Really. Four days in, I don't feel bad. Yeah. All right. Good you punish. Know. And you know, this this is why I asked you to go to scraps. You know, I, I gave him the breakdown of Kenji balance. <laughs> <laughs> that's what, that's what I did. See, now he's jumping. He's forgotten his training. <laughs> Yeah, he's forgotten his training. <laughs> he's forgotten it already? Yeah. The training. Well, habits are bad to break, you know, and like a lot of people's habits are jumping in this game. Yep. So. Yep, mine is definitely growing as I play oh, more Tanya. Good. Did not run for some reason. But Pig is mad. Pig has adjusted a little bit, but remember, he still has to go through six games. So that's six games Zeno can learn. Yep. How to deal with this. So who's the better learner? What? Who's the better learner? Out of these two? Out of these two. Pig is really good at picking up player habits and breaking them for it. That's so you're uh, saying Zeno's not smart? You're saying he's stupid? I'm saying he's not as good as picking people's habits up. I'm just messing I was trying to bait you into, huh? blowing, I was trying to bait you into blowing him up. But oh, didn't. no, no, no. <laughs> um, yeah, he, he's definitely not the most methodical player. <laughs> I'll say that for sure. I do the same thing as you know sometimes, where I get too reliant on one focus on focal no, point we of my game. No, we were saying that. We we're like, man, he's jumping and trying to teleport way too much. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's what, oh, I feel like I have over. to. I feel like I have to do too much with her. Yeah. But I can just simplify it just down a little bit. Yeah, yeah. You know, I tell a lot of players just take a breather, like for literally one second in game and block, and then like it totally mind fucks people. Like, why is he just sitting there? <laughs> you know. Right. And then you act. And that's what I was telling uh, him to do with uh, as big to do is to delay his like projectiles some, because then it's not on like a systemized pattern, and then you yep. can always counter that. Yeah. I right. like that he's opening with that. Let's get that I full do too. screen armor. Two good. Kits. <laughs> it's very good. Oh, and this is where the pain starts. But he lets him jump out for free. Yeah, that's not <laughs> what you want to do. That is not what you want to do. You, you know, especially as Cassie, you got the flip kick. You have a lot of time to react to that stuff. I think it's so good at knowing when to jump out, though. Like, That's true, true. He knows when to do it. And this is his game. He uses the screen. He's very good at reading away. people's momentum. Yeah. And uh, Kenji is a good character to take advantage of that. <laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> uh, little fake teleflurry there, standing green. See, I like when he does that. Yep. that. That's why I said that was the best thing he did in the last matches. And the he, best thing about that is not only does he get the 12%, but it gives him the space that he wants oh yeah. to do more of this. And it puts the fear into them. Like, people start questioning, man, should I even see? He's throwing yep. gunshots. Like, that is absolutely the worst thing you can do against Kenji right now. But he did it. Why? Because he got thrown. He felt like walking in wasn't working. But, you know, I, it's like poker. You know, you, you don't play based on the results all the time. You play on your system. Oh, the run-up throw again. And he is just punishing the crap out of him coming in. Ouch. And the brutality that's automated. That's what the, the sword hits <laughs> on the knees? I didn't know that. The last one, yeah, it does a swipe. I can't even tell where it hits. Pig stretching his uh, left arm, his uh, control pad arm. Might be cramping up from all the games he's playing. And uh, a character select screen. That's kind of odd. He's switching to Green Lantern. Um, that's such a pet peeve of mine. I hate it when people go to character select and pick the same character. <laughs> like, I understand you want a little bit of time to think, but like. You don't like that? Let yeah, them think, man. But I, I, I'm just really old school about that. You know, when you What's play the old school rule? Well, you, you usually play it at an arcade machine, and you don't get a character select. You press start, and you play. <laughs> you know, and you have people roaring behind you, so that's just the way it was. But anyway, back to the game. Oh, he does the armor and messes it up this time. And Cassie. And NRS, please fix that. <laughs> There's no way he wanted to do interact with it. <laughs> what happened? Why did you do the interactable? Because uh, when you put in the punch inputs, like if you put in like a 1 2 or 2 1 really fast, it'll do the shortcut key for interactable. Ah, that's why. Yeah, it's so good. 
All right. Uh, I don't know why he didn't reflect there, but that's kind of. And he was like, "Look at my knife. It's really pretty. <laughs> He's like, Look at my blade. It's kind of cut it. you magically." All right. Little, little steps forward. Good. See, that's what he wants to do: is make him do those. When he starts having to commit to the spirit pushes, those can get jumped. Uh, he really needs to not do gunshots. He's trying to think of new things to deal with this when yeah, he already knows how to deal with it. <laughs> He's already effectively dealt with it uh, in previous games. He's just doubting it now. Is he playing it that much differently, though, to where Pig has not changed or has Pig no, tightened Pig's, up his zoning? Pig's, Pig's improved his spacing quite a bit. Uh, he's been using that spirit push more and guessing right more often. Uh, but the problem is you, when you do that, you create... Oh, that oh. was really out of there. He that wanted was, to chug uh, that beer. He said if he hits an x-ray, he's got to chug a beer while the animation goes. <laughs> Did he really? Yeah. Does he have a beer in front of him? I don't know. I'll give him mine. <laughs> but, uh, well, the problem with what I was saying is uh, when you start doing that and you start trying other strategies like jumping and stuff, you're... I mean, your strategy is not foolproof, right? If it fails one time out of five, the other four should work. But if you change it, then you're increasing the deficit. Because then you're going to something that works one out of five times, then you may be screwing yourself over instead of just sticking with a game plan. Yeah. You know, it, it's just like Yomi, like Yomi levels. Like, if you do the same thing repeatedly, it's, al it's always bound to work. Like, there's no Eventually. one... There's no... Yeah, there's no one that's that good that's going to know that you're not going to you know, overhead four out of five times. Right. You know, there's very few people. But if you just keep, like, trying to change it up and do stuff you're not used to doing, I mean, they're just going to do more damage to you while you're figuring it out. And in a tournament, that's not when you should be figuring it out. You should be figuring it out later. I mean, there's no wrong options. The wrong option is whatever the opponent guesses that you're going to do, and they punish you for it. That's or, the wrong option. Yeah, but if you're doing options that you can't yourself execute well, in tournament setting, it's not a good option to begin with. Well, that was me tonight. <laughs> yeah, you know, if there's something you're trying to do that you obviously haven't trained for well enough, uh, don't do it. See, he, he he destroyed him with that string, that baton string, the first game. Yeah. That's the first time he's used it in this set. And it's no, already that's been not reset. True. He's used it. No. He used it. In the first three, did he use it once? He's, I promise you he used well, it. Well, he used it a hell of a lot more. Well, you're probably right about yeah. that. Uh, yeah, I didn't there. see the first see, look set. How bad he's blowing yeah. him up. Like he literally hasn't blocked that low baton like correctly one time. I don't think one time. Because normally he would like cancel the gunshots, but he's never had to do that yet. Yeah, he can't do the gunshots when you start blocking it. Yeah, correctly. yeah, exactly. I haven't seen him have to resort to that. Good, he contested the dash for it and didn't respect the armor. He is very good at those anti airs. Oh my like gosh. It. It's insane how good he is. Yeah. Like I was telling people, the better you put the better people you play, the less you can jump. <laughs> yep. Yeah. The lead's too big. At this point he should just let the next one hit. Just so he does get meter. Yeah, <laughs> don't let him get up, any more meter. Just give up the round. You're not it's gonna like make cape. That. Yeah. Okay, one meter down. Half a bar back. He needs to jump at that range, but he's scared to because of the armor. But if he empty jumps, he can block the armored move. Ooh, he gets a lucky break with the catch. But got armored out. <laughs> Pig is in the zone right now. And it's he all unbreakable just... damage he's doing. Yeah, that's another great thing about Kenji. Oh, very that good. That jump in is also godlike. Yeah, it's like Kung Lao's hat uh, jump in. Very strong. All right, this could be the momentum he needs. Okay. I feel like he should have gone for damage at that time, but the throw is still good. Oh, and it always converts. All right, so it's not going to be 6-0. It See, is. Uh, how much damage did he get from that stream? <laughs> right, so the new set, it is 1-0. 1-0. Oh. See, those first three games mean zero. He could have been scouting this whole time. We don't know. Probably not. He was, but. He was, he was <laughs> scouting him just to get into build habits. <laughs> Very good. That string is blowing pig up big time. He I just think has to block low. Oh, and then he block blocked high. it. There you go. 
Oh, oh no. That's not what he wanted. Wow, he's... The drops are real now. His execution is dwindling uh, as he gets hit by more baton streak. Oh my goodness. Xenomorph. Oh. oh, he went for the offensive breaker. It right. gets thrown into the corner. Right that's back the worst him. feeling ever. All right. He needs to know that's negative, though. He needs to apply pressure after that string block. You know, Tenchi has no meter yet. He could have just steamrolled him. You know, it bothers me, Harold, that you're probably top two players here <laughs> and you're not in the tournament. Uh, I wouldn't say top two. I mean, I put myself behind you guys. You're better than me, and you're uh, definitely a contender with these two guys playing yeah. right now, so. I'm not better than you. Absolutely, you are better than you me. Have, you have barely just figured out your character. Well, that justifies what I'm saying. You're I haven't even me. had a character yet. You play all your characters better than <laughs> me. You're Liu Kang bodying me last time we played, and I still dropped Liu Kang. <laughs> He's a definitely a different style, that's for sure. Like I told everyone, told everyone, you know, I'm really just enjoying the game, learning it. It's really fun learning all the characters. Yeah. But back to the match. I love that bait that Pig does right there. He throws out a lot of stuff just to make you want to go in and then like... Yeah, he was trying up. to get a teleflurry there and he, yeah. he got a standing three instead. He lucked out. That gunshot would have got stuff. Very smart. He does a raw duck, neutral duck. That string. Wow, he forced a breaker out of him with that string. Oh. You remember when Zeno thought Cassie's down oh, four was 20 goodness. frames? Yes. <laughs> it's 20 frames. Just I was like, block it. And it's punishable. Well, like I said, he's not the most scientific player. <laughs> but he knows, his, he knows his character. He, he knows his character quite not, well. Not the frame data. Oh, is it, is it combo time? It's combo time. Oh, I thought he was going to do the legit combo. He knows what to do in different situations. No, he's, he doesn't he's know why. He's played a lot of games. Oh, played yeah. A lot of games, yes. He's one of the guys that has been grinding this since the beginning. And yeah. he's been meaning cash the whole time. Yeah, yeah. And honestly, to his credit, I mean, that's a smart thing to do. When a game's first out, it's high, low, mid, mid, overhead. Just block low and then high. Hey, going nuts because that string uh, blew him up. Was it 2 0 now? Yeah. Other, other way around. It's 2 0. This is. Uh, or 0 2, however you want to look at it. Yeah, match match game for uh, Xenomorph. Let's see if he can block that string. Yeah, if, honestly, if he can block that string, that's. Really, uh, I don't want to. I don't have the heart to tell him, but that's going to lead to the next part of the game. <laughs> and so now he's doing the overhead more. Yeah. And it's just. Oh, oh wow, he actually beat out the Cassie kick. All right, a little breaker there, but he still gets pushed out. If he can keep the game here for a while, he's probably got this round. Very good. Oh, no. Oh, missed input. He did not want to do a one-two. I was trying to do a back one. And he catches them. Has he done that overhead at all? Uh, that, wasn't, that wasn't the overhead version. Can she? Yeah, that, that was actually the string that's not overhead. Because huh. he did the third hit with the uppercut. Oh, that's the mid? Yeah, yeah, that's the mid mid. I thought that kick that's was safe. an overhead, but... Yeah, it looks exactly the same as the overhead. <laughs> Weird. Yeah. Can't she's bad, though, I heard. <laughs> There's a lot of bad characters in the game. Yeah, he, he is figuring out that Xenomorph does not know Kenshi's frame data. He should really mess with that, start doing some zero strings and armoring. Pick just needs to get one game under his belt. He needs this game. He needs he needs this round very badly to cut the momentum, but this combo's... Oh, he dropped it. Oh, oh that this gonna... is going to be devastating if he wins this game like this. Nope, the string. The string. <laughs> he's, got a, he's got missed inputs. Yeah, he's... Uh, He's got to stay All focused, right. though, and just work through it. I'll tell you one thing about Pig, though. He plays angry. Like, when he's angry... Yeah, some players play he better. He plays better. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's definitely uh, different motivating Block factors. Low. Block low. Yeah, the last hit overhead is very slow, so, I mean, you can pretty much block low. I'm surprised that he doesn't know that, though. Well, the, the problem is he doesn't recognize the string, because not a lot of Cassie players have been using it. It's actually a very powerful string. Um, but what happens is, since you see it, it's not the the low option, so they assume it's an overhead. And so then they get hit by the... Ooh, and that's punishable. Yes. 
the meter burn is more punishable than the regular one. Is that Correct. true? Correct. So to use it for armor is really a risk, and this could be the game. This is the game for sure. He's kind of block train. It's over. Yeah. And Xenomorph wins. Battle Xenomorph through. takes it back 3-0. He runs it back 3-0. Low high. Block low high. Xenomorph. I don't think telling him low high is going to help right now. <laughs> That's what I told him earlier. It's the same thing. If he chooses to take a different it's high, low. on him.